No, is this thing on? I think it is. What is up, guys? Faltor here. I got the lovely... Wifey. She's the best Who's thing that... She's very, uh, you know, she's the best thing that's ever happened to me. But you say you're comfortable? Yeah, in my, my dressing. <laughs> dressing. All right, so... How do you I am... I'm setting up the game as we record. I uh, want to go ahead and just tell you guys a few things before we get started. There's a reason why she's sitting next to me care to tell the audience i'm gonna watch him play blast she's gonna play blasto for the very first time but there's a twist to it oh, <laughs> oh i finally got my hands on it after well i've known about the game since i was like what birthed Anyway, it took me this long to finally obtain the strategy guide to the book. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you so much. He got it for me. You an MVP. Thank you, John. Y'all are MVPs. I love y'all. I already read through it, and oh my sweet Jesus, this is my favorite page. I have never seen this, not one time in my entire life. That artwork is insane. In the membrane. Hmm? We're going to insert a picture. Yeah. Either that or I might just leave it like this because, you know, if any of you guys know me, on YouTube, you know I'm just, I'm very lazy when it comes to editing. This is the little storyboard for it. Eh. Oh yeah, 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 you're right, you're right. Let me, let me do this, let me do this, make it better. So I completely forgot that we're in a small box. I'm sorry, I'm just very, very excited. I'm very excited. Let me, here, hold this. Give me one second, guys. That way I want to edit it. I'm eating cucumbers and carrots. Yeah. I'm dipping them in ranch. All right. So now I'm going to show you guys the artwork again. Look how amazing this is. I mean, come on. It's my first time seeing this. It's my first time owning one this is another cool one it's like a little storyboard but there's a reason why I have this there's a reason why I have this uh, out because what's gonna happen miss wife over here or no 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 mrs. wife over here she's gonna be playing blast though and I was thinking at work you know what I am going to make a video with Blasto with this book, but then I'm like, Delilah's never played it, and she always been on my butt about, if I played it, I'd immediately get a game over. So I want to see if you'll get a game over. I doubt it, because I got cheat codes in for you. Now, what these cheat codes do, the O, it cycles through all your weapons, okay? Except for one, which you'll like, you'll get it at the end of the game. Well, two of them, but you'll get those throughout the game. The S, when you're swimming, you don't run out of air. So that means you can stay underwater. Ooh. And Guys, we got a pool in the front yard. We do. We do. It's huge. <laughs> and we, we need that cheat code so we can stay underwater. <laughs> I'm going to say this. I hope you guys can hear us for this to be a first. What the heck? Did you see that? But I hope you guys can hear us with the music playing because I did a whole bunch of 
tinkering with the audio stuff. That so the R in each time you pick up a health, whether it gives you a little bit of health, full health, or even fuller health, it'll be fuller health regardless of what you pick up. The U, I think that's your blue laser. So if you die, you come back already with a blue laser. The L is a charged shot each time you come back. It'll shoot out charged shots. So with you having blue and the charged shots on, it'll shoot a white laser. That's like the strongest laser in the game. So unless you use rapid fire, it'll shoot out blue, but you're still strong as fuck. Um, so before I recorded, before we started recording, I hit start with the cheat codes in and it works. If it doesn't work, you guys will see an abrupt pause in the video and then we'll come back when we get it fixed. Hopefully that doesn't happen. So we're going to skip the cutscenes too. We're going to skip the cutscenes so you won't fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it works. Here. All right, now what? Something to drink. I'll, I'll, I'll be all right. Are you sure? No, but I feel right. Okay. So now, what I'm going to do, we're going to, um, there's a page full of guns. Um, I can just give you a little run through, and I'll show you how to actually move with Blasto in a sec. So basically, this is the gun that you start with. Mm -hmm. This is the little lightning bolts that upgrade your gun like to like blue, but you already have that, so you got to worry about that. That's your rapid fire. That's what you have now. This is your flamethrower. This gun is your best friend. Mm. What that does... Adam Scatter. Adam Scatter. What that does, if you're surrounded by a whole bunch of enemies, mm. shoot it, and it obliterates everything. Mm. And then this is my best friend. This, this is... the freeze one? No. This is the heat seat. Oh. Uh, you, you're probably going to need that with uh, flying enemies and shit. Uh, this one right here, this is one of the guns I was saying you're going to get later. This one shoots out aliens. You're going to need that in episode 9 to get across. I'll show you how to do that. This is the gun you need to kill the snarf. That big ass blue monster. This, you'll need this when you beat the game. The ice gun. Oh, I got to keep this book open. Yeah, so you want me to play through the whole game. Yeah. It's not going to happen in one night. It's, Probably not even in one week. It's not. We're going to take time. But tonight, you're probably going to be doing two stages. Okay? All right. So. <clears throat> I'm going to do it like this. <laughs> All right. So, what I'm going to be doing over here with this special handy dandy strategy guy that Carlos and John helped me get. <sighs> I am going to be reading through it for her. All right. First things first, Blasto starts off by running down the ramp in the domed area. That's where you are now. He stops facing the direction. He stops, comma, facing the direction he needs to travel. Have Blasto backflip, which is down in, you're using an Xbox controller, so down in A at the same time. There you go and head towards the flashing square on the floor. <laughs> yeah. I got, look, look. I'm gonna have like a, <laughs> a <laughs> got like a, a, a serious face. I tell him all the time, my hand to eye coordination is not good when it comes to games. Right. So. No offense. <laughs> All right. No support. All right, so now press A to exit. I thought it said X. It says X, but X is like down here where A is, but you're using an Xbox controller. So just... Oh, when it's I, a PlayStation game. Yeah. So I'm not going to read all of the little pieces because mm -hmm. I'm going to just sum it up make the video quicker. Mm -hmm. So now press back A again to do a backflip. All right, now hold up. And just keep going. You're going to see your first enemy. When you see your first enemy, hit the X button. 
Or better yet, go ahead and stop real quick. Go ahead and try out all your buttons like X. That's the shoot. And then B, hold B. Hold it. That's your rapid fire. And then your left trigger, he dodges left. Or right with the camera. And then, um. Yeah. Okay. Now, hold the left bumper. What is that? Up here. Yes. That's the that's the look around. So you want to hold it, and then like that. You're gonna need that in level two. I'll show you when we get there. And then if we make it, <laughs> hold the right bumper. Now press up. Like hold up. Oh, you walk. Yeah, but only uh, if you uh, only if you hold R one or right bumper. So now you're gonna see your enemy when you go up to that light and when you see him just press square or the uh, fuck press x or b do whatever you need to <laughs> i'm gonna be like that guy that you like watching yeah <laughs> now why he don't disappear too don't hit me he's covering shoot him there you go I there you go. <laughs> now, now, whoa, 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 whoa. You got training wheels on. <laughs> you don't want to go too fast. Oh, mama, you okay, baby? All right, all right, all right. So. No, she can't save you. You're playing this one. No. You're playing this one. <laughs> Say hi, YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. Do the boogie with me. The monkey. All right. So, don't fall off. Right. Because that's good instruction. That's good instruction. See the, see the blue areas? Don't go there. Follow the green. Follow the green. Alright, how about you? Oh shit, there's an enemy. What? You know, don't, don't fall! Keep, like, follow it. He's gonna be in this little wall right here. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> Run, girl! You ain't gonna fall. Just stay, just stay off the will. edges. Just stay off the edges. Come on. He's right in there. I can't see! <laughs> what? Why did I backflip? Use left and right to turn. You ain't gotta press up and down. Ah. I think I killed him. Yeah, you you, you, you killed him dead. Now, 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 now. Those platforms right there, mm -hmm. center yourself. Center yourself so you can go down there. I jump. But you can actually run, so just hold up and don't stop until you get off those platforms. Cause what this, what they're gonna do, they're gonna fall if you stay on it too long. I hate them. I oh, hate them eyeballs. All right, now go in there. There's a health. That little steroid pill. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you backing up, dude? These control systems. You're, you're pressing down. All right. Now, you can't go in there yet, so turn left. Go there. Like, keep going. Now, you can go up there to your right if you didn't have cheat codes, but all it's going to do if you go right, it's going to give you, like, a... It's going to give you the rapid fire, which you already have, so you don't have to worry about that. So, go left. Yeah. You got to press that button. So go to it, center yourself to it. You can dodge if you want to. Just don't dodge too much. And just press Y. Why? Because you got to slow it down. Yeah, I see what you did there. All right, so now center yourself. Because you're going to have to go through that. Turn left a little. Okay. Now, as soon as it goes down and come back up, run. Oh my God. <laughs> my heart dropped. It's a game. <laughs> so, 
These things give me anxiety. All right, so turn left. As soon as it come up, hold up. Don't turn, don't turn. There you go. I'm not, I'll be trying to turn, dude. This thing just, it's just, it's just on drugs, so maybe I ain't right. <laughs> All right, now go, no, turn right. You gotta go up there. Now, when you get up there, yeah, go that way. Go what way? That way, the left. Go, the left. And then, you're gonna have to get on that moving platform. Do I have to jump? You don't have to, but I would just be on the safe How side. How do I jump? A. And then jump on that. <laughs> I'm done with this game. It's too much. Oh my. You want me to show you? How, you? how to play the whole thing? Maybe. I mean, we'll take turns. But when it comes to the bosses, I'm going to go ahead and let you know right now. When it comes to the bosses, you're fighting them. No, I'm not. All right? And it, look, it ain't going to be hard either because you got special weapons. So I'm going to play the rest of this stage. I'm going to work my way up to a boss in level two, and you're going to fight it. All right, so this is me playing now. This is me. Y'all see that? I don't really gonna sit. Yeah, mama. Okay, you go. You can go. I'm here. I'm here. Yeah, <laughs> so you gotta go up here too. Press this switch. You remember that one area I said you won't be able to go into just yet? Yeah. That opens it up. So now you come back down here. Okay, now run! Okay. Oh, and ju just to show you, just to show you, this is what I was talking about. If you break all three of these glasses, it gives you another rapid fire. And uh, before you guys that are watching, before you guys start complaining, no, we're not about to 100% the game. Um, if anything, the only thing I would do off camera is probably rescue the babes. Because some of them are tricky to get to. And Delilah's going to be playing most of it. So if she can't get it, I'll get it off camera. So that way you guys won't be complaining or anything. Yeah, Alright. Press Y. Thank you. Now, ow! All right, so what you just saw, that's a do not press button. There's plenty of them in this game. I know one of, I've seen one of the do not press that makes his head get bigger. Yeah, that's in stage three. There's one, you, uh, this, right. This cheat code where it cycles through all your weapons, there's a do not press button at the end that gives you that. But it's like, it's a one-time thing. If you die, you don't get it anymore. The do not press button? Yeah, you don't get that upgrade. Okay. That gave me anxiety. Why? I don't know. Tell me it don't look like it lined up. <laughs> Alright, so, um, I'm just skimming through it. Cause I don't even know how long the video is right now. Hold on. Oh, we're at 20 minutes. Okay, cool. Um, what? We're at 20 minutes. That's crazy. We spent half of it talking and laughing, <laughs> which tells me one thing. This is gonna be a funny ass series. Cause I'm gonna I'm go ahead and tell you right now, babe. I'm not playing through all this. You are. Yeah, huh? <laughs> and I've played this game for well, since I've been born, so. Okay. Try again. What? Yeah, it's my baby right here. But what? What you? 
try again. Yeah, he told some shit she's been born. I mean, basically, his mom played it. His dad played it. My mom played it. played it. My mom played it. No, my mom and uncle. They played it briefly. They played it briefly. It don't matter. They got played. Now, so we might do it one episode a week. I think that'll be fun. Yeah. Keep the minds. You know what they want to eat. Mm-hmm. And I don't know if I ever told you, but I'm not uploading this on my gaming channel anymore. What are you uploading? To my uh, regular channel. What's... Fucker? Mm-hmm. I want... Basically, the reason why I did it, uh, before I get into that, let me just tell you, some stages require you to, like, backtrack, so you can pick up lives or stuff that you missed, but you won't have to worry about doing that, because I'm going to get you as many lives as I can possibly get you. Okay? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, and you're going to hate episode seven. Was that Amyville? Yes. You're gonna hate that stage. If you're wondering why I know so many questions or, you know, able to ask these questions with substance to the game, it's because it's all he plays. Well, it ain't all I play. He played. plays Blasto, he plays Mega Man, <laughs> I Ninja, Contra, I Ninja, Ape Escape, old school games. I don't like this. I'm going to be honest and excuse my language, but I don't play this new shit. Like, I don't like online games. And if there's a way you can play those games locally, I do that with my brothers. I don't like playing online. I just prefer platformers like this right here. I don't like new games. Now, if it comes to, like, when it comes to a new platformer um mom i'll play that or no not play it i'll watch somebody play it but you won't ever see me play it 16 17 i'm missing some lives what the hell what the heck oh no no i remember you died I only died once though yeah it was supposed to be no you died twice Oh, y'all jumped. <laughs> yeah. I was wondering, because I'm like, usually by the end of this stage, you end it with 20 lives. What, you got 18? Nah, 16. Then the math ain't nothing. I'm about to have 17. This is the ice gun. 17. Damn, I can't, I'm going to be honest, I can't even remember, because I only seen you die twice. Pokemon. Unless, unless there's a life I didn't pick up somewhere. Oh, I think it is. I think I missed one up top. Alright, so right here is a lot of backtracking. I'm going to just walk you through it. You want to play? Alright. So, you see that red or that pink shit on the doorway or whatever? That way? Yeah, you can't go there yet. So, turn left. Turn right. Or right. Turn right. Go that way. Mm-hmm. You got it. Jump up there. Ah. Just press A <laughs> and hold and hold forward. There you go. And jump up there. And then turn left. And jump up there. Now there's an alien right there, so go ahead and start shooting. So now, what I like to do, mm -hmm. the camera's going to move downward when you jump forward. Mm -hmm. 
So hold, like don't don't go yet. But what you're gonna do, like turn right a little bit. All right, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna run to the edge of this block, mm -hmm. and then you're gonna jump and keep holding forward. And if you do it right, you should land on this square down there. You're gonna run to the edge of the block. And jump. Press now, eight. when don't press it, hold it so you oh. jump higher. Like, just tap it. Now, hold it. Okay. He, he jumps a little higher. So you're gonna run. And hold, hold. A. And you're gonna keep holding forward, too. And you should be able to hang. Like, you should be able to get up there. Are you ready? Yeah. There you go! I did now it! Now turn right before you die. Get a, you gotta climb up there. No, well, didn't say so. And there's gonna I be a- I you to move! There's gonna be an alien up there. Go, go, turn, turn right. You can't hit him! You gotta, you gotta get up there. Alright, now turn left. There you go! Oh, this is gonna be your big challenge. Your first big challenge. Turn right. Now hit that button. Why? You have to, you have to press it to get that moving so you can get across. Oh no! Yeah, buddy. No. Yes. It's all about. It's all about the one thing you have trouble with. What? Eye coordination. Or in this case, since you're holding the remote, hand-eye coordination. So now, <laughs> I'll let you go about two times, and then I'll help you. So, you're going to have to turn right a little, because you're going to have to go through that. And then, you know how to hold forward and jump. Go. Uh. Go to the next one. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! You almost got it. Come on. I'll give you one more. One no! More. I want to do one more. Come on, one more. God, no. This is a long stage, but it ain't. Girl! <laughs> <laughs> hey man, after this, I'm done. I can't do these games. Yeah, you can. This is me. Come on, Despero. Oh, Lord. I hey. used to have a game it was called The Tales of Despero. On a DS? Excellent. I can get that game if you wanted to play it for YouTube. But this camera angle is what's going to mess me up. All hey. right. <laughs> now, nah, I'm going to show off. But watch me die, too. Watch me die. So, you want to jump on top of this mm -hmm. and then jump up. I said jump up. Hang off of that. Oh, oh! See, look at him. He been playing this game for years. I don't know nothing about Blast other than what I learned from him. I will tell you this. We're playing basically digital controls, and what that means is you can't use the analog sticks. Like, I can move it around. But it don't work. He, yeah, it don't work. Analog controls is what I used to start with. Like, growing up, I used to play this game with analog controls. I don't recommend it because he, he's too slippery moving like that. But I'm bringing that up to say, when I started playing, basically, when you move your right analog stick, he moves around like this. But without this blue square in the screen. And I used to think, to turn, you use the right analog stick and you just move with the left analog stick. Mm -hmm. But I found out years later that Blasto is actually, he moves like a tank. Didn't even break a yeah, threat. that like, makes sense. Like, you can move forward and back. Mm -hmm. You can't move left and right. If you press left and right, he turns like yeah. a tank, which is so fucking crazy. All right. So, basically, when I say this stage is backtracked like hell, that switch I just hit opened up another doorway. You remember the beginning of the stage? Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, there's a switch in every corridor, and it unlocks the next path. Boo -boo! Oh shit. You can check on her, baby, and then just come back. She okay? Yeah, she's good. That's good. She just watching the TV? Yeah. Alright. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me, guys. Um, I will say, when it comes to the strategy guide, I'm gonna read it during the crucial parts of the game this right here isn't really that crucial i will however read the strategy guide when it comes to what delilah is going to be facing by the end of this video <clears throat> oh you said two stages this is two stages this is the second one but you you're not gonna walk away from this boss fight you're gonna fight the boss all right that's a funny way of saying i'm gonna die I mean, I can be blunt. You're gonna die in this game. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm not gonna worry about this one up up here. Because I'm pretty good at it. I don't mean to brag. <laughs> what? <laughs> Paranoid. Uh, that's better. Oh my god. Alright, so I'ma show you something real quick and I'ma let you I'ma actually let you play it. That was lit. Thank you. So in this area Really, like, the biggest part of this area is down that way. Like, down that way. But you don't have to go down there unless you want to pick up some uh, power-ups and shit. But I'm going to take you down there. But really, when you get down here, you just got to go this way, hit the switch, and you can go back up. Oh, and you're going to hate these things, too. Wow. Okay. Right. So I kind of figure you don't like moving platforms. Like platforms that just move. Or really, and I'm gonna go ahead and say this too. I don't mean any kind of offense to my wife. These are all just practical jokes. That being said. To be more clear, I realized you don't really like yum, yum. timing and coordination in games. I don't. <laughs> not, with, not with this. I can't. All right. So, I can't. that being said, when it comes to a moving platform, I'll help you. I'll help you get across and shit like that. So, I'm going to get on. <laughs> I did that. That's never happened before. So anyway, I'm gonna get on. I'm gonna go this way real quick. Um. Going down that way. There's gonna be an enemy. Don't shoot it. You'll see. Anyway. Oh, this is the invisible platform. Yeah, I want you to. Absolutely not. I want you to try to get up there. Oh, where? Okay, I'll try. And I mean, you can see the platforms. Like, there's a dot right there, dot right there. See what I'm saying? Do I have to jump? No. Well, yes, yes. But don't. Turn left. I said turn left. <laughs> I tried to help you. You did. You did. You did. Turn left. Right here? Yeah, turn left. 
You see the other platform? That's the jump. Star, 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 and star. That's the jump. Yeah. There you go. Now, find the next one. There you go. There you go. Now, don't move. Don't move forward. Just turn and Which kill them. Which one still has? I should shoot both of them. Yeah, kill them. Kill them. All right. Now find the next one. Now kill those bastards. Cause I fucking hate them. All right. Now Dang, you're home free. Stop pressing so much. I can't. This is my channel. Not yours. <laughs> Meaning, if we were playing this on your channel, I wouldn't be cussing. Cause I know, I know with your channel, I try to. You remember the? You remember when we were doing the thing with the um, trying to get the bassinet together? And when I was editing it, I had to censor out all my stuff. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it'd be like accidental. I'll try my best not to cuss in your videos. Mm -hmm. But if I do, I'll edit it. But here is like, I do YouTube for fun. Unless I get up there and make, you know, money and stuff. Mm -hmm. Then I'll stop. But right now, I mean, I'm just doing this shit for fun. So now, press Y. Why? Wow. Don't fall off. All right, now turn around. I'm not going back. You got to. And you got the power-ups there to help you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. I didn't want to do it. Christmas blaster. Oh, man. But basically, that do not press button gives you all of these. So if you didn't have cheat codes in, pick all these up. Because this gives you rapid fire. You get the yellow laser, and then you get the blue laser. But you got the white laser. All right, so now, when you get up here, go that way. Yeah, no, I'm going to jump in the middle. And don't shoot anything. Well, shoot that. Shoot that. You're going to see an alien walking. Don't shoot that one. Oh, that's the one that's going to the restroom. Yeah. <laughs> That's invisibility. Oh, well, I almost shot it. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Just pick that up. And follow him. Now you see me, now you don't. Now, I did skim through the strategy guide. And this part, and you can shoot him now if you want. Think of it I'm not finna interrupt this time. To you got to. Why? Watch. Watch what happens. So I gotta shoot him on the toilet. Yeah. Kill his ass. Man can't even, you know, fully excrete himself. Right. All right, don't move. So basically, this strategy guy says when you kill him, mm -hmm. you get a, a, like a shitload of power-ups. Mm -hmm. That's a flamethrower. You don't have to pick that up if you don't want it. I'm going to be honest, the, uh, the fucking flamethrower is the least useful weapon in the game, in my opinion. But basically, that's what the strategy guy says. If you kill that alien, you get all this. And then you get a maximum health at the door. All right. So let me do this, because you got to backtrack. I know you don't like moving platforms. I don't. I killed your friend when he was on the I guess you could say you killed the shit out of him. I shot it at all. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna I'm go ahead and say this. The rest of the stage is kind of moving platforms and coordination and stuff. I'm gonna play this stage as well. I'm gonna let you fight the boss. But um, after this, you're gonna be on your own. After this stage. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. How about this? I play through the game. I play through the game, but when it comes to bosses, you're gonna fight them. And like, I can do like some stuff as long as it's not like you know moving platforms. Yeah. Like shooting some enemies. Cause that guy. 
that guy uh -huh. that you watch on YouTube. Hold on. Okay. Ma. Well, guys, we're about to take a momentary break. Ma, what the world? What's she do? <laughs> I think it's recording. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and get the rest of this. Babe, I want to go ahead and tell you. I want you to... I'm gonna let I'm gonna, I'm not gonna spoil it. I'm not gonna spoil it. You're gonna you're really gonna like this part. This is really this is a really easy part. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're really gonna like this area. See so who would have thought to go out there? Right. And get a life. I can't wait for you to show. Did you ever show that part that your dad called Sony about? No, not yet. But we're gonna get to it. Not in this video. We're gonna get to it. Now. Hold forward. And then when you get in there, just let go. You're gonna play this part. <laughs> no, I don't told you, I do not like it. <laughs> he played too much. Watch this though. Watch the entire thing, okay? <laughs> but look. I'm gonna I'm gonna do something on purpose, all right? Mm -hmm. I want you to watch something. Mm -hmm. Look how long this path is. Mm -hmm. Look how tedious it is. Mm -hmm. You, it's like you gotta play leapfrog in this bitch. I had a leapfrog. Me too. All right, so. That's what Mike was good. Right. So you see, that's the end right there, the end of this little tunnel. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make it to the end, and then I'm gonna die on purpose. But look where it takes you. So I'm just going to fall. If you die trying to get across. Grab a mop, there's going to be guns on the ceiling. You start at the fucking beginning. And have to oh, do it. The, um, all over again. All over. So if you don't know how to play this game. I me. You're going to have a hard time getting past this. It took me hell when I was little. It's almost like I'm just taking you to the past. <laughs> if you think about it. Last to the past. Ooh. Get your character out. I'm out of my snacks. You know, I want to go ahead and uh, talk about this in the video. Me, you know, I don't want to die early due to being unhealthy. Which is why I've been trying to cut back on the stuff that I normally eat. Because, and Delilah will tell you this too. I don't really like vegetables like that. And it ain't like I just can't eat it. It's literally like if I try to eat it, it'll come right back up. Even if it settles in my stomach. But there's been times where, oh yeah. These motherfuckers you don't really have to worry about because all they're going to do is distract you. But if you're skilled like me, you can shoot these bastards. But again, you don't have to. I like those hits. But um, th this part right here is completely optional if you didn't want to save a babe. But you do have to go down here. What else were you saying? I was saying that. I personally don't really, I don't want to say care, but for lack of better term, I don't really care about eating healthy, I guess, but Delilah's been uh, eating a lot more fruits and vegetables and I'm very proud of her on that and if anything if anything when it comes to me I want to push her to doing that like motivate her so I'm saying that to say baby I'm very proud of you just just keep at it just keep at it yeah yeah you guys I got a goal I don't know exactly what it is but I know I want to 
buy our anniversary, which is in October. Mm -hmm. here for three years this October. What? We got married in 2021. I think she dropped something and it sounded really small and solid. <laughs> Mama, what you doing, baby? Yep. We've been together since October 13th, 2019. And then we got married October 6th, 2021. She had one of these little sorry pieces. And then I was like, how you get that? She gonna lay on the floor. Did she shake her head too? <laughs> no, she laid on the floor and she was trying to hide and just started laughing. Oh, and you're gonna hate these things. You, It's rare that you're gonna see it. But you're gonna hate these. I'm gonna just show you a little bit. Little bit. Oh. That was So is that the same as the thing that pop up out the ground? Yep. Except with those that come out the ground, um, they just keep shooting it. Once these things. What kind of cheat code was that? They hit you and blew up, and you didn't lose no health. Oh, sometimes it'll glitch out. Depends on where you're standing. Oh. They'll blow up and won't hit you. But that's... I ain't gonna say it's rare. But it it happens sometimes. Okay. So that right there, that's your alien gun. And this is basically a death trap. If you get this and then get this... Yeah. Oh my goodness. Right. Ooh. You gotta go back down and try to find that glitch. <laughs> no. I don't need it. Right. My mom. Oh my god, I fucking love this gun. Damn it! Stop hiding from me. So yeah, I want to look slimmer and then I'm gonna keep going. Especially for my birthday, turning 26 this year. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm married to a cougar, guys. He gonna be 25. Mm -hmm. 25. Turning 26 this December. I'm excited, child. Well, you know, look healthy. Be here as long as I can for us right now. Our little girl. And in the future, the rest of our kids. But right now... On the whole hill, and we trying to be here for her, right? And each other, and each other. My buddy, yeah. um, I, I'm not gonna disclose his name because he might be embarrassed. But let's just say he lives across the street from us. He's a really cool guy. <laughs> he's a really cool guy. He's a really cool guy. He he's into practically the same stuff I'm into. He's he's a pretty cool guy. But, he told me, um, and I really need to get serious with it, it's pretty hard because, you know, it's hard to get out your comfort zone in a lot of things. But, he told me about this diet that I could go on considering I like to basically eat anything with protein like meat, chicken, or anything that has meat. Or fish, right? And I don't know if you can eat fish on this diet. It's a carnivore diet where it's like you're eating nothing but meat. Fish. No. Yeah, fish. No carbs. And I mean, I'm, I would take it. I would take it a, a step further. Because there are times when Delilah would cook vegetables. And I would eat it, but even she'll tell you that's a rare commodity. I mean, it's even rarer than a Stradivarius. What is that? Ask Jack Black with the uh, saxophone. Even more firepower. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> one, two, three, four. One, two, three, motherfucker. <laughs> Jack Black. I it's, love Jack Black. It's this for me. Before he counted down, 
It's like he was doing this. Like he was tuning it, and but it, it's a toy. <laughs> and he looked at it like this. He said. Alright, so this is gonna be your boss. It's gonna be your first boss. Ooh, Don't I worry. Was, I was gonna say my first death, but I think I'm gonna die four times. <laughs> but look. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm getting you through all the hard shit. Oh, boy. Considering you have cheat codes, bae. Considering you have cheat codes, this is not a hard fight. So what you need to do, right? Oh, is this the butthole one? No! Oh, okay. <laughs> Why you called it that? Because, uh, 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 uh. Hey, did Blast out of one who was like, uh, I don't need to borrow chapstick from that or something like that? You'll no. see when we get to it. You'll see why I said that. The better, the better example is when he looked at it and said, my God, that thing better be your mouth. That, that's what he said. Yeah, you'll see. All right. I called it the butthole one. So what you need to do, you see he's not jumping high enough. Yeah. You need to hold jump. And look how higher he's jumping. Okay. Yep. You need to hold jump. And as soon as you get to the top, hold up so you can get up on the platform. Okay. Alright, all right, better yet, when you get on the jumping platform, because you're probably going to have to jump back on it. As soon as he jumps up off the platform. As soon as he jump up. Mm hmm Go ahead and start holding up. There you go. There you go. Ah! Hold, hold B. Hold B. Turn around and hold B. Hold right. I got to get left. in a good position. There you go. Come on. And look, if you die, you come back up here. So you got to worry about jumping. Don't run me over, you skirting mother. <laughs> mm. So you about to bring it up out of me, man. This will this will be a try not to cuss. Yeah, for sure. Not for me, cause you know me. Hey, you killed him! Hey! <laughs> and you dropped my remote. Hurry for they kill you now. Who who else are there? <laughs> yeah, dog. No. When did they bite you to the cookout? <laughs> <laughs> and like they ran up for the we can't oh. get a plate. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> All right, uh, am so, I gonna die? No, as long as you know how to shoot. But press that button. You should know how to at this point. Yeah, I think I know how to press a button. Wow. Mhm. Mm and now, now you got three more. Three more what? Of those switches. The blinking lights. Okay. But there's gonna be an enemy, so. That's why I was saying, as long as you know how to shoot. You know, I always thought my hand out coordination was gonna be terrible with the shooting because of that guy. Yeah. But mine ain't even as bad as his was. <laughs> I mean, this, I this mean. This is only with shooting enemies, though. It, it ain't like I'm good. He done played through the whole game. And I ain't even got through a full stage. <laughs> So. But, I'm a, but look, but look, but look. It's not, it's not the YouTuber. Do I pick that up? It's okay if I pick it up? Yeah, that's a heat seeker. But you're probably going to lose it. No, you won't. Because I'm going to play the rest. Oh, well, we're done for the night. Yeah, because this is the end. I got one more, right? Yeah. I'm going to go get that one. Because you're going to need that. <laughs> Paranoid. That thing pop up, you be like, wait a minute! Press down. Okay, now. There you go! Now do now do back A. There you go. Now I get to go pick up a babe. Mm -hmm. Come here. Yeah, yeah. Get that! Okay, okay, don't move, don't move. It'll come, it'll come back up. Press back. Okay. That's a life. 
All right, now what I do? And here, here, here. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh, boy, I, I was I was starting to tense up, y'all. <laughs> starting right. to tense up, like. So what I'm gonna do too? I'm gonna play the. Uh, I'm gonna play a little bit of the third stage. And um, just until I find a safe spot, because I don't want to start back on this stage. Like I said earlier, I hope you guys could hear us, because it. I did a lot of editing with the volume and shit. So I hope you guys can hear me. Bitch! Get the fuck out my face! Bro, I'm about to run out of ammo! Damn! Now, you wanna know what would've made this horrible, babe? If I told you, hey, do like how I did the very last time I played this game on my channel. Meaning, go through the whole game, don't pick up any power-ups, and you can't pick up lives. Yeah, that would be, like, completely unfair because you know the game. I, the only thing I knew about the game was the name. Yeah. You gonna tell me not to pick nothing up? <laughs> no. <laughs> what makes it worse is that... I, I play the game, right? Mm -hmm. And even I couldn't do it. Even I couldn't go through the whole game without picking up any power up. Right. It's not designed to do it's a, I'm pretty sure it's a fun challenge when you know, you know the game, you know the platform, you know where the enemies go pop up, you know where the health is, you know where the lives are, you know where the babes are, you know where the exits, the safe spots, you know, all that good jazz that makes the game good. But when you don't know nothing but the name, right? And a few little points here and there that you hear from, you know, your partner, or your husband talk about the game, cause he plays it. That's not a good challenge. That's like a death threat. Like, are you just isolated me? <laughs> you don't want to laugh about it? No. I might. I might. I might. I'm just messing with you. Look at this platforming, babe. Yeah, ah! That. All right, but basically, I'm done with the stage because up there, that's the end. But yeah, I think because like I'm starting to realize you don't really do games. Mm -hmm. Like I, I truly believe it now. But that's not gonna that's not gonna stop me from saying, hey, you gonna play this with me. The thing is, I do a couple of games. He introduced me to Mortal Kombat, Galaga, and I knew about Pac-Man, but I did not play Pac-Man. And so sometimes we play Pac-Man together. We play Mortal Kombat together. And he even got one on his uh, computer where he's created a character for me and him. Which, so if we get, I mean, we could do gameplay with that. I mean, I'm a that would be fun because that's somewhere I know. I'm gonna say this. I'm going to say this. If you don't mind, because I'm at the, we're at the end of the video now. If you don't mind, we can do a short clip of us beating the hell out of each other in Mortal Kombat with no, our creative characters. I know. I gotta get my layer back. We can do it tomorrow. That'll work. What Tuesday? Yeah. We can do it. It ain't like we gotta do everything all at once. Yeah. Trust me, we have we, we got we can space it out. Get the view or something to come back to. Yeah, and these things are murdering my fucking face. Oh, and there's another boss in this stage. That, that booty, I'm gonna say it the way you said it, the booty hole monster. I said booty hole monster. <laughs> well, that too. What's up? Ah! 
So why are they different colors? I think, because see, I've had that question for a while. I think they just do a lot more damage than the next. Oh yeah, that would be a perfect time to read it. Let's see. I've been into the game, guys. I'm, I'm very sorry. Um, So I've already saved it. I'm going to go ahead and do this real quick. Oh, uh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. You're on episode three, right? Yeah, you got the booty hole monster. You got it. Because I ain't finna fight. I'm a... What? This thing is... Mm -mm. Ugly? <laughs> yeah, it's like it's real anime. <laughs> and it's like... <laughs> it's been not booty juice. <laughs> Ew. Booty warrior? No. Um, I don't see it. And you you know what you're looking for more than I am. Okay, let me check my phone real quick. Yeah, I'm trying to text Lauren back. Who? Lauren. Oh, how's she doing? She's doing good. That's good. Give me! Get your book. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, that's episode two. This is still episode two. All right. I knew it. What? I knew it. That get difficult? Yeah, I'm going to read it out. I'm going to read it out. That's the cool thing about reading this thing. It gives you information about some of the enemies that you probably never would have known about if you're just playing the game. Which is the case for me right now. So, we know, well, I, I told you before, yeah. off camera, that the aliens, the pink ones, are the weak, the weakest ones. The pink ones? Yeah, these. The green ones? Oh, oh. Yeah. The ones that wear pink? Mm-hmm. The ones that wear yellow is like an in-between. They're weak, but they're not weak. Is this the iBots? Yeah. Well, they look way better on here than they do in the game. <laughs> yeah. They but, look way better, like three-dimensional instead of just a flat mm -hmm. ball. But um, later in the game, you're going to see these, but they're going to have red. Those are the strongest ones. And they do a lot of damage, too. Those are ones in Alienville? No. The no. ones in Alienville, some of them wear pink, some of them wear yellow. Oh yeah, so so the the ones that were orange there, later, like you said, later on in the game, is that are they in the game, um, in the part where you gotta where you fight them, where you shoot them black ants, or is that alien? The black ants? Yeah, that's that's later in the game. Those aren't aliens. I say ants. They're not ants. What are they? I get to it. Some things is ants. But let me let me read the minds. So the level one flying mines, that's what the book says. Those are the red and yellow ones. The ones in level two. And by the way. What they look like? It's hard to see. Oh, the little star things. Yeah. That's what he's talking about. The red and yellow star things. Because I am. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But I want to I want to say, too, that the alien with the yellow or mm -hmm. orange, you killed some of them already in level two. So. But anyway. Level 1 Flying Mines. These handy little guys hover in the air until Blasto arrives. They then zip to a random direction and circle Blasto before crashing into him for some damage. They can be tough to shoot and a pain in large numbers. Then it got Level 2. Same idea as the Level 1 but a bit more damaging, a little faster, and they don't circle as long before putting the smack on Blasto. Those are the green and yellow. Yeah. Okay. Level three, I'm assuming that's the purple one because it said it shows green. I'm assuming those are the, mm -hmm. like down there, it's green and yellow. Yeah. And then these first two are red and yellow. But I'm assuming the three is the purplish ones. Mm -hmm. It says same idea as the level two. But still more damaging, even faster, and they don't circle as long before putting the old kibosh on Blasto. So, it got to the purple ones are the level three. Yeah. 
the ones that we just saw that that killed you really quick. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. And um, that's about it for level three. This is an interesting little book. Mm -hmm. Little booklet. I wonder if all the games do this. I mean, it would be nice if they did. But they used they just to. have everything, you know, electronic. Like, have something nostalgic. <clears throat> but let me go ahead and show you the name of those black creatures. Okay. Right there. Read that. Evil dark creatures with spooky red... Evil dark creatures with spooky red eyes. That's the name of the black ants. You gonna in see? The, they look like ants to me. In the instructional thing. Boo -boo. Bro, this video is an hour long. What? <laughs> what are they? At the bottom. Yeah, you're not posting this whole thing. I am, and will. No. But no. Uh, in the in the instructional manual that comes with the game. Mm -hmm. They're actually called evil deadly creatures with spooky red eyes. I give you, I give you, they're, uh, they're black ants, everyone. Black ants. I'm gonna see. Hold on. There's another enemy with a funny name. There's two. Really. Hold on. Hold on. That with a baby. Oh, I mean, when I poo poo was born, when she was born, y'all, she was six pounds, 13.8 ounces. Mm. I was so tiny. I could fit right here. Put it right here. I could fit right here. Mm. Okay. <laughs> here, hold Where? this one. Now read that one Zargon Jelly Bean. That, that. That. The little purple shits from level four. That. It's called Zargon Jelly Bean. All right. All right, I'm done. <laughs> Thanks for having me and seeing me. Go support my channel. Keep it away, Mrs. Ortega. Her yeah. Book, the link to her channel will be in the description down below. I hope I didn't just ear rape you guys. But uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a like, leave a comment, and if you're new, smash that subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you get notified when another video gets uploaded. Peace.